the snowy mountain tops, right? You go on the other side of the snowy mountain tops and you're in the Sahara Desert. So one thing we forgot to mention to you guys is the first thing we're doing today is um, after we've had breakfast, once we leave from here, we're going to um, a village or something. So one omelette is mine, peppers and onions and a pancake to try. This is Midge's, what did you get? Peppers and onion as well. Sick. And then you got a donut. Four pancakes Four. with honey, but the honey is running to my scrambled eggs. Oh no, it's not working properly. What do you do? Life hack, easy. Yeah, we saw that on Facebook or Insta, and now she's just doing it everywhere. Right guys, so we've just finished breakfast. It's 9.30. Obviously we didn't show you the main thing in it. That's just so typical of us. But this is the entrance to the hotel. So I've got these huge chairs. We've got a water fountain thing going at the back. We're just waiting for the tour guide to figure out what bus we're on. We just showed you guys the view of Atlas Mountain and all of that. So just want to give you a quick view of um, an actual Berber village. Um, so these are the locals. Um, they used to be Jewish, Christian. That's their village. Quaint little town. Their houses are made of clay. Only in recent years they've started making their houses out of um, cement and stuff. So the water what makes it mean? turn. This is the water main. It's the next right to back of the water. You can look in here. This way is water from the river. And there is the door by the water for moving the stone. And this is the basket that's really for Jibli, for like between the bar and my and way. And this one is a small wood for to make the vibration for like this, for when you put the green hair, for to make the flower. And this is the debris, it's turned for like this, for change direction, the water to step and the stone. And there it's sitting, it's for the growth and the thing, the flower. And this is the flower, the barley, for to make the couscous and the bread for barley. You can to pick the picture for the green for looking at the... Ah, the question, just for the fun of you? No, this one is the... Another family of the mountains is public. And the family of the mountains go in the head. So we use it for to pick the uh, one of the, 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 the flower for like this. After I give the family the house 10% of the flower, not give the money. So you give the give 10% of the flower. The family's private hammam. So they'll come in here, they'll have their bath. I'll have a hammam in here. This is um, a kitchen. So that is to make couscous. Um, it's where they wash their dishes and stuff. Up there they've got their spices. And um, the lady, I think she's making bread. This is the parents' bedroom. There's like proper intricate carvings on the wooden bed. And... Um, Behind us, there's like these huge shelves. I'm guessing they'll keep like their clothes and extra blankets and stuff like that. This is their living room. So I just chill out in the sitting room. And then this is their garden. Yes, yes, yes. Where they get to just chill out. There's a little swing. You can hear the river somewhere. And there's Doggo. I'm just chilling. We're just playing in the water. <laughs> Up there. I'm guessing that's where we were when I videoed. <laughs> Basically, walking on this bridge here, and I could feel Gupri walking behind me. <laughs> Mate! No, no. Okay. There's some. We're gonna take a picture on the bridge, guys, so we'll insert it here. Well, the Moroccan version of like, they had Tal Sakri. I think Punjabis call it Revlio. This is also very, very good for memory and also in cold countries. You can make with it tea. It okay. makes the body very warm. But yeah, we yeah. mix it with different spices. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not just this. Uh, gin, ginger. Ginseng. Oh, ginseng. 
Ginger? Ginger, maybe. Ginger. I am not uh, good in uh, spice. <laughs> <laughs> That's, right. That's okay. Go and see the ladies. Yeah. yeah. And this is the argan fruit that go by steps for the extras of the argan oil. So what else is this? This here for the first step, remove the shell of the fruit to get the nuts inside. So to get the nuts inside. For the second step, we we'll work the nuts to get those nuts inside. Inside now we have argan almond. From this almond, we make two types of the oil: argan oil for cosmetic, argan oil for eating. Oh. So for the cosmetic oil, we take just a natural almond like this and we press them here into the traditional moment to get the sweet base. And for the edible one, we need to roast the almond first and then we press them also in the same mold in here to get this brown base. So after, we take the cosmetic base or edible one and the women knead it by hands here or more here for two or three hours Whoa. with some mineral water. And after mixing, the oil starts coming out. Can you imagine the muscles? <laughs> two or three hours of mixing. <laughs> so when we get the oil, that's the rest. That's the rest of the lead from cosmetic paste. This one doesn't smell and we produce by that our soaps, our cosmetics product like shampoo, creams, body lotion. And from the edible paste, we produce our black soap. You know the black soap we use it in our Moroccan hammer for peeling. So here we have another preparation. This is the last preparation called Amlu. Amlu, it means the bourbon Nutella. It's a natural Nutella. So our bourbon Nutella, it's actually a mixture between normal almond syrup with some edible oil. It's by honey from argan flowers. <laughs> so this one we take it to with bread and We have rose, stars anise, chamomile, verbena, cinnamon, rosemary, and the goma arabic. Goma arabic is like a natural sugar. Don't put honey, we don't put honey, we don't put sugar. Do they uh, grind them up and then pour them in? Or and that's the tea. Yep. You leave this for five minutes, then you drink it. And you oh. take that out. Yeah. You strain it out. Yeah, yeah. So that's the tea we're about to have. It's so like how your dad makes it at home. Yeah, it does kind of remind me of jar. Okay, so if you finish now, you can take your cup with you. Come on, we will show you what is cosmetic. This is nice. So we just tried some uh, Berber bread with the four different types of edible things that they were showing us over there. We're going to go and look at the cosmetic stuff now. Mmm, tea's nice. Also rich with vitamin E. So this kind of the oil, you can use it for dry skin, for Thank black you. spots, dark marks, dry hair, the hair loss, <laughs> stretch marks, for wrinkles, for any problem of the skin. Um, Just to know. Yeah. The pure eyeliner doesn't smell anything. Right there. When you put it in your skin, when you massage it's good, your skin absorbs it. It's not oily, but it's not greasy. So I've just rubbed it onto my psoriasis and that feels quite nice. The water is so clear. It's just a beautiful flowing river. Going down. We're up in the mountains. So we've got a wide angle lens on. Hopefully it's not blurry. Keep up with the group, yeah. It's got music over there, got football there. And you got another snowy peak Just sitting there. I used to, because whenever it is sunny, I find many women they watch. Today, yeah. see more women, maybe because the water which is cold. Yeah, you will see how cold is it. Yeah, and sometimes they have light. Uh, it's the same type some of rooms cat. like this in the mountains they use it whenever they have snow. You mm -hmm. can leave the animal for the night oh, till okay. tomorrow. Yeah. Mm. And this is the way towards uh, the waterfalls. Oh. How messed up is this guys yeah? So look 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 over there yeah that's the mountains yeah well, you can't see it right now but there's snowy mountain tops. Look there, look, there's snowy mountain tops, right? 
you go on the other side of the snowy mountain tops and you're in the Sahara Desert. You got how many thousands of kilometers of just desert and no water and then just We're only 15 kilometers away from the Sahara Desert. Can you believe it? There's so much water here. But in 15 kilometers time, no water. This is where we're having lunch. We're gonna have some rocket lunch today, guys. Nice yard. I need Shreya right now saying, follow me. Please. Sorry YouTube, we kind of like forgot about you, but the chicken was in there, we took it out. We are fat, we are hungry and we are eating. <laughs> That's about as good as it gets. We had um, a whole bunch of starters, what did we have? We had um, like some pepper, mixed pepper something. chili olives, so they've got apple pie for dessert. It's got fresh apple on it. Yeah, um, which is so really sweet. I don't know what this is, but again, also really nice and sweet. It's like a custardy type of texture. Can you see that cave? So yeah, where we had lunch, it's a villa. So just thought we'd show you around. Welcome to my garden. Something flying past me. What's these? Tij Tijiri? Or the other one? Tajin. Look at that view. I am under attack from a wasp, so Christine will be proud of me. Sock mode engaged. I've only seen the ones that like actually just need like almost stick on and they're permanent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 